Now, I know I'm uh, putting a lot of videos up, but I like to get them up the same day. And if you look at today, it's not too hot and it's a lovely day, so it's ideal for doing this job. However, I've got another change of plan. Now, I was hoping to forge a smallish knife from a spring. And with the problems of not having a proper forge or anvil and tools and that and holding it, then having to think how to do it. So what I was going to do was just put that in and heat the bottom up, straighten it out, cut five inches or so off, flatten it out, and then do the same for a handle, which would have to be welded on afterwards. However, I don't know if you can see in the furthest. I've had it going for what, a good half hour, I think, and it's long story short, it's got to be dark before I get enough coals hot all the way through. Put the blower on for it. So, just to show you, as, I'm, as I've lit it, I'm going to do a little bit like I did last year out of these old spanner middles and just make something smaller or what yet probably something a bit like last time so because they heat up quite easily you see and of course I don't have any tongs so unfortunately I'm going to have to use these horse clippers to grab it out of the fire and hold it with some old grits you know it's far far from ideal but it's all I've got without going to a lot of trouble and expense for something that's only playing anyway you know so and uh, as I said if I'd managed to do that it certainly wouldn't be done today I may in the future do it we'll have to see but I think that project will have to be on hold for a while so we'll see if we can make something eh we've nearly got it hot enough to get a little bit of the end hot but as I say, it was uh, by the time that's gone through and I put some more coal on and let that get going and more coal and get it deep enough, it's, you know, it's got to be midnight. Right, well it doesn't take very long for this to get hot at all. But it also, of course, doesn't take long to get cold. So what I've got to do, as I say, my, well that's not hot enough at all now. A moment ago it was. But uh, as I said, it's messing about. Sorry, I've got to leave the camera set there because otherwise you won't see anything. A pair of tongs would be nice. I should really be making some, I suppose. Heats up very quickly, but it also cools very quickly. And stood up. Um, Sorry you're not seeing it. I will just, what I'll do, I'll just take it off here a second and show you. I'm pretty sure you can see it in there. It heats up quite quickly, but as I say, it's just getting enough, getting enough fire into it. And if you had enough time, you know, I've got to, no one in the seat yet, next door. I'll try not to be too much of a nuisance, you know. So, that's it. Anyway, as soon as I'll leave it on, and I'll just cut a bit out. As I say, the problem with using furnace instead of a forge, it's, uh, it's so far from ideal, but it does get it hot. And I don't know what I'm making yet either. So, if anything. Maybe something a little bit like I did before. You see, it's still hardly getting hot enough, but we are outside in the sunshine. I mean, a blow lamp would do this job, I think. Probably better. But that wasn't the original plan, was it? See it in the fire, it's red hot. But as 
soon as you get it outside in the sunshine, it's, it looks cold. Right. If this was in shade with a cloud comes over, you'll actually see that it is more than cherry red, although it looks black here. But as I said, it cools very quickly. So, you see we've got a little end on there. That's a mess of mould. What I'll do is just make a little spoon. Very shallow spoon. Just seeing if I can hold it in these horse clippers because it's uh, it'll make it. I can actually something this small. That wants beating out quite a bit more. No. Is it better than being stuck inside? Yes. With that blower on full, it's actually hot enough in there now to do it. As I say, if we had another couple of hours, keep putting coal on and get the thing hot right to the top, we may be able to do it, but uh, being as how it's um, been up this hour and a half now, I think, as I say, it's got to be, it'll be midnight before I get done, so. far away I know but uh, at least you can see everything that way so I think you can see what we've done a little spoon on the end now I've got to turn it round and just put a little bit on the little flat bit on the other end and then we'll bend it to shape fire when I take it out it's actually as hot as the fire. Because it's a small you can actually hold it with these. That's the only saving grace as I say.
knows that this, uh, <laughs> this equipment is suitable for this job. Bad work you may blame his tools, but I think when your tools are <laughs> bad as mine are to use, as unsuitable, I think they have a, a little bit of saving grace, don't we? Still not quite right, that. very short chunky spoon you see so now I'm just going to heat the middle up and bend it bend it round a bit right just got to bend that round if I can hold it still just hot look yeah that's spot on that is so I'm calling that done right just a very small job on the spur of the moment because, uh, as I say, my original plan's not going to work. Well, got it wire brushed up, look, and uh, don't even see that, there's a few little hammer marks in there. We're outside, out the sunlight, so I think you can see it. It's just a little cup shape, that's all. Slight bend in the handle and a flat on that end. And yes, it's nothing much, but it's better than nothing, eh? There you go, but the thing is, I'm fairly sure, it's proved one thing, no, I'm not going to be able to forge a knife out that spring. I'm not saying it couldn't be done, uh, but with my furnace, to get it going enough, I would have to start early in the morning. And uh, even then, I'm not sure I'd have enough energy for hammering for hours. So, one project led to another. There you go. Something to do anyway. Been two hours in outside in the, well, call it fresh air next to the furnace if you like. And, uh, you know, better than sitting in my chair, isn't it? All right. Like I said as well at the beginning, I think, so long ago, um, I put videos up. You know, mo most people, they're a month or two behind them. They've got a stock. I haven't. I just do a video and put it up, so, you know, because it was such a nice day, and I thought we had the opportunity to do it, or try it, I thought we'd give it a go, today, so, you know, so, that's why you get into many videos, but there may not be one for a few days, or there may be, we'll see what happens tomorrow, see you soon.